Children's Hospital are now required to be fully vaccinated by October 1st. Now those recommendations from a pediatric, medical, and hospital associations led to that decision, but will other employers now follow suit? That's the question. Two News reporter Aliyah Williamson asking the Lieutenant Governor and other leaders is trying to find out. Yeah, well, Mark and Brooke, we've seen that some people are already following that example. Today, the lieutenant governor told me he believes Ohioans are smart and that educating and encouraging people to get vaccinated should be enough. The state's vaccination rate is still below 50%, and Dayton Children's is hoping to change that. Dayton Children's has more than 3,800 employees and more than 60% of them are already vaccinated. But the state of Ohio is still stuck at 49% of people who have at least one shot. That is not near the 70% that the nation has strived to get to and not near where herd immunity needs to, to take effect. The Children's Hospital Association, the American Hospital Association, the American Academy of Pediatrics, and the American Nurses Association are all encouraging hospitals to mandate the vaccine. Dr. Mezoff says it can save lives. You are three times less likely to get COVID, eight times less likely to have symptoms if you have COVID, and 25 times less likely to die from COVID. Lieutenant Governor John Houston says he understands why the hospital is taking this step. There are some healthcare settings where for the safety of the workforce and for the customers that businesses are making that decision. But by and large, I fully expect that employers will continue and to leave that decision to the employee. But Houston says he believes other employers mandating vaccines isn't the best option. Continuing to educate them, uh, continuing to encourage, continuing to offer incentives for people to protect themselves is the best way to do it. And Dayton Children's also has a mass mandate for any and all visitors older than two. Aaliyah Williamson, 2 News, working for you.